Jacob Carver and welcome back to the butcher shop. Today I'm going to wind up my uh, Christmas in July because tomorrow is the last day of July. So today I'm going to bring you a double feature and that is Psycho Santa 1 and 2. Uh, Psycho Santa, is, while en route to a holiday gathering, young Ron teases his wife about the legend of the backwoods Santa with an axe to grind. However, when the legend comes to life, the Christmas bash turns into a holiday bloodbath. And Psycho Santa 2, a killer in a Santa Claus suit returns to the quiet town that burned him and along the way finds his son and makes the Christmas killing a family affair. So, uh, the first part when they're en route to the Christmas wherever the fuck to go on Christmas gathering. It sort of kind of plays out like an anthology and I think there's like three parts to it. Uh, I'd have to say the first part's not really all that exciting but however I think it's better than the second one because I think the first part actually has a little more uh, gratuitous nudity and stuff like that. And the second one kind of, if you're familiar with uh, Silent Night, Deadly Night of course, part twos tend to uh, recycle footage from the first film, and uh, I think Psycho Santa 2 does a little bit of that in the second one. But, you know, they're, they're not great, they're not good, they're not great, they're somewhere middle of the road. But if you don't have them in your horror movie Christmas horror movie collection, uh, you can check it out if you can get it for a decent price. So this winds up the uh, Christmas in July. Hope everybody liked the movies I watched. No, I mean, some of them weren't that great, eh, but some of them were. So this is Jacob Carver from The Butcher Shop. Until the next time, let the blood run red.